Do you boo boo? Do you boo boo? This year, I do you. I was running through the six with my. The mistake that I made in the past. One mistake that I made in the past is not taking emotional of how beautiful I am. She's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever She leaves her safe space She leaves her safe space Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Talita Twitcher says, if you're new here, my name's Talita Samila Matungwane and thank you so much for clicking into this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Click the notification button so you get notified when I upload a new video. To my old people, to my old subbies, thank you guys so much and I am so happy to have reached 700 subscribers. Thank you so much guys for being here for your girl. I love it. You know what? It's you loving me for me and I love you too. <laughs> is about fetching your life um this is a new year we all have like um resolutions so guys everything that i'm gonna be saying here is um definitely um subjective and relative so i'm gonna be like talking about stuff that would work for me but yeah yes i know for a fact that if you're fetching your life like as long as we are all in the same boat fetching your life is fetching your life like landing below yeah do the most this year do the most for yourself, do the most for your dreams, that's your life, man. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna be doing is, um, I'm gonna be, I'll be starting my hair. So the first thing that I would do, like, uh, just put like a bit of water over my hair because it's so cold, because I don't want to spray um, all over my hair because it is too damn cold. The cold front is upon us. Um, So guys, I just wanna talk about the importance of fetching your life first of all so the importance of fetching your life or like what like basically fetch your life means to me um doing what you've been not doing getting up and doing life no matter the circumstances um getting up each and every day and doing what you feel is meaningful to you like doing things with your own meaning understanding yourself getting to know yourself better each and every day and doing what um, you love finding pleasure in what you are doing i know um that is not easy like we've all had a rough year 2021 was the ghetto but this is a new year guys it necessarily mean just because you're having a bad year you're having a bad life no nope. Um, so right now I'm gonna go I'm doing my um, skincare routine like there's nothing wrong about my skincare routine but what I like about these products is that they work I think they are working like my undertone has completely changed um, I have uneven skin tone blemishes and like and all everything that you can ever think of anyways but that does not shake me like nah I'm not I'm not that big on skincare because I know if once I get into it I'm gonna start losing money and I don't want that for myself anyways as I was saying, so you have to start doing things with your own meaning. The moment you start doing things with your own meaning, you guys, that means that requires you to be a little bit stronger. You know, um, stand firm. You know, that's like one way of fetching your life. Stand firm, know yourself, um, know what you want. Do you have to stand firm because there are external factors or external threats to your dreams, to you being yourself, just doing you basically. So for example, um, we have Instagram, social media generally. We have family members that are toxic or family members that always want to um, project their insecurities or whatever they didn't achieve. Nope. Stand firm, know yourself, do things with your own meaning. That's one way of fetching your life. <laughs> and don't forget to take good care of yourself. The moment you, you take care of yourself, you'll feel good. The moment you feel good, you'll do good things. I promise you. Okay, so next thing that's important, guys. I feel like, like when you're fetching your life, it's important to develop a routine. You know just have a routine it doesn't have to be too hectic because routines are difficult to follow like it's, it's really not that easy but you have to you have to just push yourself and eventually it will feel like um, breathing you know so I read somewhere that um, pineapple peels are good for your skin this is actually my first time I'm supposed to be straining it but I don't have a strainer 
um, so apparently they are good for your skin just leave them oh my goodness leave them to boil and then um, let it simmer for like 20 minutes and then so right now I'm just gonna quickly install my wig I wanted to make a smoothie but I'm like because I'm doing um, um, a detox week like I was actually on my day three but today I'm not gonna do it because I'm going out for brunch and I don't want to like have to run to the toilet when I'm on my way to the spot um so anyways guys develop a routine it doesn't have to be a difficult routine because now for example i don't like my routine is quite simple and it's winter guys like don't put too much pressure on yourself so i should basically just every morning mondays to fridays i wake up go to i wake up take a shower make a smoothie and go straight to work abc that's my routine and it makes me feel good you know and it's um even like after work i just take a shower go to bed because i eat at work if i have to snack like i just get up and like and do a little snack but i don't put too much pressure on myself like on routines um wake up journal meditate because i'm not there yet i can do those kind of things in in summer but in winter no i can't i don't do them because it's cold like it's difficult getting out of bed so it's just a lot it's the simple things man you know if you're looking for a job just get like just know that okay every morning i'm just gonna wake up check my e check my emails i'm gonna wake up check on so and so who said this and that would happen you know just like do things that like a routine a simple routine that will help you get in in line that will channel you into what you want to do in what you are trying to achieve i think that's like best isn't it say thank you talita teacher <laughs> Guys, this is the way, the hair that I want to wear. <laughs> Why does it look like this? Like I washed it a long time ago and I feel like I asked, I, I need to wear it today. Like I want to style it. I want to see if it's going to look great. But yo, it's going to take me a long, long, long time to like, because I want to wear my pondo here. Like I just want to look cute, man. America, I need a break from hysteria. Park like the one with the carousel. I get it. So I just used got to be glue to s install my hair. Guys, I made this hair myself. So if there's so much going on here that you don't understand, just know that your girl made her own hair. Before we continue with the video, I just want to quickly show you the big canvas head that I bought. What in the biggest head in the world is this? Honestly. Like I bought it in extra large, like guys, I, t I did tell you guys that the app is in English, like uh, Amazon, I mean, is in Chinese and like, I always buy the wrong thing. Like sometimes I don't even like care to translate. I just buy stuff and hope for the best. And Goku san, <laughs> what the hell? Oh my God. Ah. Okay. So before we continue with the video, because now I'm going to be, um, I'm going to be laying edges. This is the glue that <laughs> That I'm gonna be using. I'm so embarrassed. Like this is so embarrassing. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna be laying edges. So guys, what I'm trying to say is, um, fetching your life begins with you personally. Let me go and get a pair of scissors because it is. if you know that you have toxic traits, because everyone has toxic traits, good and bad. Like not, and like we have good toxic traits. For example, um, like sort of good toxic traits that's what i'm trying to say like um allowing people to walk all over you um because you're a good person and so on and so forth. you're trying to be a good person but that's toxic to you like those are the kind of things i'm talking about and if you know that way now you are closed-minded or you're read books read books watch vlogs that will open your mind watch videos open uh follow like um good instagram channels and instagram accounts like that are good for you that are good for your soul you know like i feel like that's what builds us like what you you allow to influence you then get that way you are like following the people that influence you into like follow the people that are in the same wavelength as you you know and then get that way i get you'll be fetching your life for real We'll be fetching it. I, mean, I didn't just open this YouTube channel. Like I knew that I wanted a YouTube channel, but um, I started following people that had channels as well. Like I wanted to see how it's going, the ups and downs, the do's and don'ts, the whatsoever's. Yo, I said I'm going through the most with these edges. 
Yo, Jonga, it was almost impossible to lay my edges because, wow, what did I just go for? But you know what? No mission is impossible with me. I'm not Tom Cruise. I'm Nelson Mandela's daughter. It always seems impossible until it's done. That's my brand, honey. That's my brand. So guys, I'm gonna go on and do my brows. I'm gonna look at myself in the mirror. So guys, I'm deciding that the kind of person that you want to be also applies. I'm with representation, like how you present yourself, right? Um, how you show up as a person. Like, um, you need to show up looking fine, girl. That's why it says makeup here. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go in with this um, NYX or NYX um, primer. Oh, guys, Nagi, I'm not that good at applying things. I'm just gonna be applying because, child, I'm not a professional. I'm just doing me, right? So, um, I think I put too much of it. Oh my god, I did, right? I did. I'm getting ashy. <laughs> Okay, guys, I don't have like a specific routine for my makeup. Sometimes I do my brows first. Sometimes it's the primer that goes first. Something, something is definitely wrong with this primer. What the hell? I'm gonna remove this primer. Oh, let me just let it be. Okay, I'm gonna let it stay. I'm gonna let it stay. So as we were saying, or as I was saying, um, present yourself well, like show up looking good, wherever you're going. Like there's a saying that goes like, show up looking cute wherever you go. Cute get is subjective. Your kind of cute is not my kind of cute, but just be clean. Hygiene is important, you know. If you're not hygienic, if you weren't hygienic last year, which I believe none of my subscribers is unhygienic. Fetch your life and show up looking cute everywhere whether you're going to buy bread i'm not saying take out your um your best clothes or in fact <laughs> just like um be look okay you know like how you want to be you love to be addressed it's not like a matter of people being shallow or whatsoever guys one thing about me i always have a debate in my head like i'm saying something another opinion is coming like no you can't say that's wrong that's toxic to myself that's being toxic to myself brows are so dark like they're quite dense so um i just like fuck at the corners at the end and then do the shape and then go on with my makeup routine makeup uh, routine my makeup routine is not that bougie because you know what uh, <laughs> i'm not that bougie self child but you know what this year i'm gonna be the bougiest guys ulindiwe mistakenly or i recently took her lip gloss and this lip gloss is bomb ass i don't know if i'm gonna steal it or if i'm gonna take it back but Woo! Cha Ooh, cha guys this is what friends are for when you're fetching your life get yourself good friends okay don't forget get rid of friends that don't want to give you their lip glosses uh, guys i'm out of breath only from speaking only from talking because like guys when i talk i, I don't know I too much i put too much effort in it it doesn't make any sense guys please this is my foundation that i'm using that i bought from taobao for 20 rmp do you know why because it's very difficult to find my shade in this country this foundation it's quite good um but what i don't like about it um it doesn't it sometimes oxidizes especially when it's very hot um when i hug people so i don't like taking hugs when i'm wearing this foundation you know, you know, like, I just, like, want to be, like, child, because I look cute when I'm wearing this foundation. Like, the shade is amazing. But what I don't like about it is that I can't even go to bed with it. Like, when I'm too intoxicated. It happens sometimes. It happens sometimes. So, now, I'm going to go in with the foundation. Guys, so, fetching your life. This year, don't take things too far. Don't do that. Whether you're fixing or... Or letting go like just let go of things you know and be a person who's able to move on from stuff if something is not working don't take it too far man like just drop it and move on to the next one on to the next one on to the next one we move you know because if you take things too far you're basically wasting time and we don't want that we don't want to waste time it's it, like time is the most valuable resource you can 
possibly have so please don't waste time on things that um don't matter don't drag don't th take things too far if you're having an argument with someone if you can cut it short do that if you're having an interview um just cut to the story cut to the chase say what's important with your cvs put the most relevant information the most relevant experience you know like don't take things too far don't drag stuff atamazulu zulu people would say udrama pass don't try my pass straight to the point cut to the chase simple kiss it keep it short and sweet so guys everything takes practice right i know look at me i'm doing my makeup in front of you guys and i'm not an expert and i'm okay with that you know be okay with like starting things and not being perfect and being an amateur and um learning like in on stage learn learn in the process learn as you go because that's what we do like if i like when i'm watching my first video like when i watch my first video and some of my videos i cringe i'm like girl what were you doing but i'm okay with that because everything takes practice so the moment you keep that in mind sorry you'll be able to start and do anything and everything that you ever wanted to do in this world trust me i promise you that is a promise from me to you Ooh. guys now i'm gonna go in and put my lashes i just guys now i'm not doing makeup according to who says who i do it according to me sana you are uh, because like following routines that somebody else would tell so now you go in with don don oxalayo it's all going to be in one face at the end of the day so this goes to say <laughs> not me justifying myself but like guys um don't do things you don't have to do things by the book all the time as long as you're doing like as long as you're not harming anyone just do what you think is right you know but don't harm yourself in the process don't harm other people in the process be mindful of other people's feelings and everything and everything or you yourself your future and everything but you don't have to do everything by the book child that's what i'm here to tell you otherwise you won't able, you won't learn you won't learn that's how people invent like things or people come up with like different styles because they were trying to do something new and they were like oh my goodness this actually works and then nabanduke fall so guys this is a visual representation of doing you do you boo boo do you boo boo this year i do you i was running through the six with my walls you know how that she go you know how that she go i was running through the six um do -do 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 -do. Oh, guys that's my song yo I. guys am i the only person who cries like who actually tears when they're doing their makeup because i get over emotional of how beautiful i am <laughs> i'm kidding guys it's because my eyes are the ghetto like oh i go through the most with these eyes yo 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 and you know that i inherited this from my granddad and my dad like their eyes are always red sometimes i get eye infection and i get those like blood balls in my eyes and i'm just i just look at his game all of a sudden you need an entire hodoba only dollar an entire Mendoza looking like a skibbing. Okay, so now I need concealer. <laughs> Supposed to have put concealer a long time ago, but you know what? We don't do things by the book here. Yeah? No, we don't do that. We don't do that. Oh, guys, my eye. Oh. Guys, another thing um, that I actually just thought about this year, just take yourself seriously. You know, like the mistake that I made in the past, one mistake that I made in the past is not taking myself seriously. This goes um, with like how you joke about yourself. Now I'm used to, like I used to be a person who hide um, or who hid like mostly behind my insecurities using humor. And you end up like, um, you end up not taking yourself seriously like you laugh at everything you share like you joke about yourself about how ugly you look sometimes like um you joke about your problems and i feel like do that yes because but to a certain degree 
don't say bad things about yourself for example, be modest yes but to a certain degree like a little bit of everything take yourself seriously be modest laugh about stuff but have limits you know don't because now i had a problem like of people not taking me seriously like some people would say when now you can cook it's because of how like i presented myself to them yes i know people will have opinions about you and some but sometimes it's how you represent yourself if you don't take yourself seriously nobody absolutely no one will take yourself or will take you serious fetch that serious it makes you basically decided the kind of person you want to be so i already know that like my character i'm aware of my character i know that i like uh, like i like to play like i always play about almost everything but where does that stop you know i don't know no don't do that to yourself don't do that take everything that you do seriously like there's this video that i watched the other day a sermon by i forgot this guy's name he's a pastor he preaches and he's a motivational speaker he's young tall and handsome from america i'm sure you guys know him like he said um serve every phase in your life with pride take pride in what you do take pride in the kind of person you are like just take pride in jane everything Nyama. be proud you've got a big bum just like my boss said the other day oh my goodness like i put in line for saying pejorative stuff about my body or having like remarks about how i look and whatsoever and now i'm sure she's in line because i did put her in line uh, period Yo, ah ah, drops mic, drops brush. <laughs>
one thing that I've been forgetting to mention is finding balance. Find balance. I know like I read one of Gabrielle, um, Gabrielle Union's books. She says, I'm finding fat balance. Like it's difficult to find balance and whatsoever. But like, um, I feel like um, finding balance is also very much subjective. If you are... Um, this is how you find balance. This is how I find balance. I take baby steps in everything that I do. I used to be like a very impulsive person, but now I take my time when I'm doing things. For example, say you have like your New Year's resolutions and you want to eat, eat um, healthily, you want to exercise, you want to start journaling and so on and so forth. Do one thing at a time and get used to it and then on to the next thing. So it doesn't feel like a lot, you know? So the moment you want to like start exercising or start running, um, run for like a week or two get used to running and then the moment like it's okay it's you're used to it it feels like breathing then you can you can start journaling you know and then get used to journaling and then start that new diet that new diet that's how you find balance that's how you that's how you balance out like things that you want to do in your life baby steps one step at a time you know because like where you're rushing to my love we know like life is short you only live once but take your time you know that's what's up also find balance in like the things kind of things that you do there's time for everything the bible says there's time for everything um drink with responsibility like take accountability for the things that you do and learn from your mistakes um so drink pray meditate um gossip but keep it short keep it lovely um like just balance because gossiping is nice but don't be toxic don't don't do don't do too much of it um like just try to balance out everything say good things about people see the good in people but be able to also to tell when i add this this leak like just balance out everything and you'll be good bit by bit a little bit of everything is key Keep your bitter. I'ma make a better. 
thank you so much for subscribing. Thanks so much for being here. We tipsy. Cheers, Julia. Cheers, 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 cheers. It's been lovely. It's been great. Thank you so much. Bye. See you in the next vlog. <laughs>